Hello and welcome back to our video tutorial on how to create a basic process model in our web author client. Here we can see the process model we created last time in our web client and now we're just going to expand on this by adding drill downs to further expand the process to make it easier to understand for our users. So if we go to our edit diagram button up in the top corner here we'll then be once again greeted by the edit screen for our web process. Now we have these small arrows up here in the top corners of each box. These will create our drill downs. So if we select our drill down here and here and here and then save this and if select it again, we will go down into our draft process. So now we need to further create our process from here with our level 1 1. So we're just going to make a bit of movement here. Just so we have a bit more room to operate. Perfect. So we will now start mapping our drill down process. And again, we can add new activity boxes as and where we need it. We can expand out. I'm just going to create this. need to adjust some of the lines as you need to. Remove this activity box for the time being. As I would like to move this onto this line and this down here if I can. We just need to add one further activity box. Again, we have our basic outline here. I just need to add our bow lines in between. the button again so we can just spread this out a little bit so that we have a bit more room to work perfect just need to bring these up here so everything's in line Realized I have some of these boxes the wrong way around. That's not a problem. You can just drag and drop around. Just remove the flow lines because they'll just get in the way for the moment. Realign your process. Perfect. And then just redraw these lines.
just need to add our last one that comes off the far end. And there we have it, our first drawdown. We can just save this here. Hit done for the moment. So now our process is here. Now if we go back up to our top level using the top button here, we can now go down to our next drill down, which will be blank for the moment, and we can edit this diagram, and so on, until your entire map will look something like this. So you should end up with something like this. So if we select the Diagram Explorer here, we can see how my drill downs have been added. You can see lower and higher as needed. And those are all our drawdowns available. And you can just navigate this as you normally would in the in the author client. So you go through, everything's fine. You can navigate up to parent diagrams or back to top level at the top. And that's all there is to creating drawdowns in the web client. So next time we will be looking at resources. So until then, thank you very much. Mm -hmm.